Hey guys, my name is Dave and welcome to another video. So this might be kind of an odd topic to talk about, but something that has kind of gone through my head a lot as of late is the idea that without something negative you can't have something positive. Now, a lot of people have heard similar statements before, like, without dark, without there, without the light, there's no darkness, or vice versa. You can't have darkness without the light, is what I'm, that's the phrase I'm thinking of. And, honestly, in a sense, this is something I, kind of a belief that I've held on to, probably more than a lot of other things. The idea that without without resolve, you can't have conflict and vice versa. It's probably the best way to put it. Without conflict, there is no resolve. Without resolve, there's no conflict. Many real life scenarios can actually present what I mean by this. Most notably, or at least one of the most notable ones, job hunting or jobs in general. You can't have a proper job without some kind of conflict going on, especially a job you enjoy. I think a good example of this would be when people start up like on this platform. I mean, a lot of people look at like the higher, the bigger YouTubers and go, oh, they've always been so big, but the reality is no, they haven't. There are some big YouTubers out there who have gone, and there are some who watch my channel who can ask, actually testify to this too. And I know this for a fact because I've talked to them about it. But I digress. There are some YouTubers out there who you'll say that and they'll be like, yeah, no, I was stuck in a rut for blank amount of years or blank amount of months, depending on what kind, which rut you're referring to. This could either be based off likes, shares, Subscription. It really depends on the point in time that we're referring to. This is a good example. I, I think I just think YouTube is a pretty dang good example that a lot of people who come on here can actually relate to. Like for me, like mine's a very, 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 very small channel compared to others. But where I am right now, I was stuck in the rut of having like ten to fifteen subs for three years, and just suddenly, boom. I get this large leap of people who are very supportive, and I'm aware of this. And it's very humbling to see that. This thing can apply to more than just YouTube, though. If we're talking about other kinds of jobs, how about retail or uh, fast food? Probably one of the job groups that gain the most crap on the job. I know because I've done both and they seriously gain more crap the employees gain more crap from the higher-ups in these groups more than anything else for the most part but it's definitely the most notable and I mean some people like the jobs and they stick around because of the job itself that they like but the people that they work with sometimes are so crappy that it makes it feel like for a, te a temporary amount of time that it's just not worth it. But the job itself, when it's enjoyed, is always going to have that kind of conflict. And it's kind of one of the natural laws of life, I guess. When you enjoy something, there's going to be a big conflict that'll make up for all the enjoyment coming from it. And it's horrible to think about. A job is just one example. Another example, which I've seen happen way too many times, is a relationship. When a relationship really goes well with no flaws, there's always going to be that big, big hitter that'll just come and slam you down, and all of a sudden it's like, oh, should have figured something was going to go wrong. Now, whether this is in regards to something that is based off an action that's done from one side or the other, 
or whether it's because something has just hit both of you at once and it, you both just kind of need to give your efforts in, that's kind of when things really start to go into realization of this is definitely for me. And it's not just relationships. It, jobs, relationships, real life situations, like, I don't know, for some people, uh, when they work out, you'll work out, you work out, things will go well, your body's getting in good shape, and all of a sudden, something hits you, and you get some kind of um, medical problem, just out of the blue, and it's like, crap, and might push you away to actually try to keep going. These conflicts exist to equalize the light, the good. Now, if there's a small amount of good, there's going to be a small amount of conflict. People might look at it as bigger than what it actually is, but the thing is, conflict always is equivalent to the amount of good. Now, I know personally that uh, a lot of people have a tendency to look at the negative at, as way more bigger than the, what the, it actually is which kind of overpowers the light, but that's just kind of the mentality. Either way around, though, yeah, it's it just... You can't have one without the other. That's just kind of the hardcore truth, which sucks. Either way around, though, yeah, that's my thought on that matter. What do you guys think? Uh, let me know in the comments below. Uh, if you like this kind of stuff, first of all, make sure to push that like button in. So far, you can't see it anymore. Second, share it out. And third, please consider subscribing to the channel because I do uh, one of these live videos every day. And if you want to support the channel, if you're already subscribed and you want to support a bit more, consider um, checking out the, my Patreon. I built it a while ago, but I haven't really shared it just out of nerves. But a couple of my friends have going, yeah, you should share it out. So I'm like, here we go. <laughs> I might change the links on the screen to show a link leading to it and then the other one being the sub if so then they'll be here along with the icons for the videos or the for the playlist just above them i don't know we'll see either way around though thanks again for watching this video guys once again check out the links if you'd like otherwise i'm gonna head off and i hope to see you guys in another video bye for now